हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम अगेन टू डेज टेस्टिंग कंसेप्ट टाइप्स ऑफ रिस्क अबाउट दिस वीडियो इन दिस वीडियो विल बी डिस्कसिंग अबाउट इनहेरेंट रिस्क रेसिड्यूअल रिस्क कंट्रोल रिस्क डिटेक्शन रिस्क एंड ऑडिट रिस्क सो दिस आर द रिस्क दैट एन सीसा एस्पिरेंट शुड बी अवेयर ऑफ ISA ka generally tricks us and try to confuse us between these terms but now we will not let them play with us here concepts have been simplified for easy learning happy learning let us discuss about various types of risk first one is and very important one is inherent risk inherent risk is basically risk before controls we call it gross risk then we have residual risk residual risks are the risks after controls so we take inherent risk we apply the controls and what we get is residual risk now control risk control risks is basically ineffective controls though controls are in place they are not effective we do have detection risk basically it speaks about ineffective audit then we do have audit risk audit risk is sum total of inherent risk control risk and detection risk we will discuss about all these risks in detail in our next slide let us differentiate between inherent risk and residual risk so first inherent risk the risks that an activity would pose if no controls or other mitigative factors were in place we call it gross risk or risks before controls residual risk risks that remains after controls are taken into account we call it net risk or we call risks after controls so now how to differentiate both the term we do have inherent risk residual risk inherent risk is the gross risk and the residual risk is net risk risk before control risk after control so if you take inherent risk you apply the controls and what you get a residual risk so now let us discuss about the control risk what are control risk risk that a misstatement could occur but may not be detected and prevented by entity's internal control mechanism that is ineffective controls here though controls are in place they are not that effective what are detection risks this is ineffective audit risks that the auditors fail to detect a material misstatement in the financial statement so what is audit risk audit risk is sum total of inherent risk control risk and detection risk let us discuss some question to get the concepts more clear so for example business or process to make an error that is material in nature assuming there were no internal controls so when there are no internal controls there 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 is inherent risk so answer here will be inherent risk control risk means the risks even though controls are in place is not effective detection risk is the risk where auditor failed to identify material misstatement in financial statement we'll discuss one more question the risks that the controls put in place will not prevent correct detect errors on a timely basis we already discussed this control risks let us discuss one more question the actions of an is auditor are most likely to affect which of the following risk whether inherent detection control or business auditors risks basically will impact detection risk detection risks are the risks where auditor fails to identify material misstatement or error in financial statement Again inherent risks are the risks without any controls control risks are the risks where control are in place but are not effective one last question 
रेक्स ऑफ एन आई एस ऑडिटर सर्टिफाइंग एक्सिस्टेंस ऑफ प्रॉपर सिस्टम एंड प्रोसीजर सो अगेन हियर इन इफेक्टिव ऑडिट एंड सो अवर आंसर विल बी डिटेक्शन रेस्क ओके सो वन मोर क्वेश्चन log reviews may not result in timely detection or correction of error this is an example of inherent control detection or risk condition risk now log reviews are basically a kind of control but they are not effective in the sense timely detection or correction of error is not happening so even though controls are in place they are not effective so risk that we are facing here is control risk Thanks for watching. For more such videos, please visit datainfosec.blogspot.in. All the best for your CSA exam.